This video was recorded with the Aver Media Live Gamer Portable. Skip it up and that up. I'm getting pretty good at Black Ops 2, and I love when I win death matches that people always accuse me of cheating. <laughs> so one guy was like, I don't get it, man. How does he have an MP7 and he was in last place and I have a shotgun that's diamond studded and I have platinum nipple tassels on in front of my TV. How does he win? I don't get it. Something's wrong. Yeah, it's called I actually play by the rules, don't camp, and use overpowered weapons. Just saying. So here is one that is going to piss off all of the Wii U haters. I sat on this because I wanted confirmation. I didn't want to jump on rumors with this. But man, oh man, it's good news whether you hate Call of Duty or not. It has been confirmed by Activision today that Call of Duty Ghost is definitely coming to the Wii U. This is what Activision had to say. Featuring an all-new world, story, characters, experiences, all powered by a new engine, Call of Duty Ghosts is a stunning leap forward for the blockbuster franchise. For the first time in Call of Duty, gamers play as the underdog, fighting as part of a single squad against an enemy that has superior numbers and firepower. Call of Duty Ghost genre-defining multiplayer delivers gameplay innovations throughout, including dynamic map events, character customization, and other features yet to be announced. The title includes Wii Remote and second screen Wii U gamepad support and more. Call of Duty Ghost is scheduled for release November 5th on Wii U and is not yet rated by the ESRB. I know I'm going to sound like a prick right now, but I got to do it. This is so satisfying, man. <laughs> there were so many people, and you know who I'm talking about, who were like enjoying, savoring the fact that Call of Duty Ghost wasn't confirmed yet for the Wii U, and they were putting up, well, I was in the uh, 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 gas station bathroom, and I was looking on the wall, and someone actually wrote down that Call of Duty Ghost for the Wii U is not coming. They wrote it actually in their fecal matter, and I thought I should report on this. Then you got dudes looking through gaming magazines, and they're looking at the platforms for Call of Duty Ghost, and it's not there, and they're like, oh, see, it's not coming to the Wii U. The Wii U is officially irrelevant. It's like, really? You're, you're going by that as evidence? Did you look on the web at all? Did you look anywhere? You're just, you know, looking through a preview in a magazine, and because they don't list the platform that that's your proof you're putting up videos like that to just to piss people off and it works it brings people to your channel it makes them watch your videos but i can tell you right now you know news for views even though i do news all the time but if you're just putting up a certain news story just to royally piss people off and that's the only kind of news that you do it only works for so long man people get sick of it after a while okay i had to I know I went on a rant there, I just had to get it off my chest, but what does this mean for the Wii U? It means that it remains relevant. It means that people who may, you know, they know Pikmin's out, they know the Wind Waker HD, the Zelda game is coming out, they know the games in 2014 are coming out, and they may be like, hmm, you know, I really like the Zelda, or the Nintendo exclusives, excuse me, the Zelda exclusives, listen to me. And on top of it, you know, I do like playing Call of Duty once in a while, and Call of Duty Ghosts looks cool, and I'll get both on the Wii U, Okay, I'll pick up a Wii U. <laughs> you know, it, it, it help, it'll help drive sales when people know that Call of Duty will be on there. You could hate Call of Duty all you want to. Call of Duty royally pisses me off too, even though I play it, you know, and they recycle the damn game every year. I'm playing it, and I could still admit that. But people buy the game, and if people know it's going to be out on Nintendo's platform... It'll entice people to buy the system knowing that they could get Call of Duty and they could get Nintendo's, Nintendo's exclusives on one system. It's the bottom line. It's a fact. So anyway, folks, make sure to rate, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And as always, thank you for supporting Review Tech USA. Have a good one.